What's up everybody? This may be the very first in a series of competitions where I challenge you to design something. So the very first challenge is starting today and it ends in two weeks. So the submission deadline is December 2nd. And so this is the fir very first challenge and I'm going to go into detail about the challenge and what exactly it is. You're going to download this Figma prototype and which is in the YouTube description by the way and make sure to watch this whole video to see exactly how to complete this challenge but essentially you need to create a horizontal scroll navigation over here on this design and with these cards and these information so up to three to five cards with the title and a description and try to make it look a coherent and as cohesive as possible so Make sure to keep watching this video uh, because I'm going to show you exactly and walk through all the steps and the requirements. But there will be two winners. So the first is going to be the best, like whoever designs the best version of this and the best iteration. And then also there will be a, uh, a random winner who's chosen just uh, from a pool of all the entries. And that way it's not just the best person who wins. Um, also, what did they win? They're going to get access to designcourse.com right here, which is coming in 46 days, January 4th, 2022. Make sure you enter your email to be notified when this does release. But yeah, the winners will get immediate access to what is there uh, currently and will have permanent access to it as is. All right, so I'm really looking forward to your entries for the submission. Um, you're gonna to actually use Discord uh, to submit your entries. And yeah, really excited to see what you all come up with. All right, so here are the challenge details. I want you to click on uh, the link here in the YouTube description, very top link, and I want you to open this up I basically in Figma and you can follow along here. And um, the way you do that is you download the .fig file and then just open figma.com and drag that file on top of the Figma interface and then it'll allow you to open this file up to follow along. And so here is a design that um, I created that's actually, you know, uh, a design or one of the challenges from the design course curriculum. And what I want you to do is I want you to take this design right here, and this is gonna be the artboard or the, the frame that you use to you know complete the challenge and simulate what happens when somebody types in something like strawberry and clicks find fruit. All right, so I'll also want you to prototype that. That's a very simple prototyping. You just take this, you, you drag a connection over here, and it would be maybe smart animate on click or something like that. Um, and then create the layout to show uh, a series of cards based on a horizontal scrolling carousel. All right. So here are the requirements. And by the way, if you don't know how to create a horizontal scrolling carousel here in Figma, um, there's a number of tutorials, uh, both on YouTube and, and right here. Um, it'll show you how to create horizontal scroll animations. So for instance, it gives you a demonstration of what I'm talking about. See these cards right here? That's basically what I'm looking for, except obviously making it well designed given the context of this design right here. So. Um, Create a horizontal uh, carousel that contains between three and five cards featuring the search results to the left. So you can use all five or you can just use three. It doesn't matter, but you need to be at least three. And do not include title uh, and the description and the design, but I do want the actual title of uh, the three to five cards that you see here. You can see that each of them are unique. And then also a description. Um, and you can see they're all unique descriptions as well. Also, I want you to use the image in some way. So you're gonna be creating cards, a card design for each one of these. Um, and like I said, three to five. Um, do not alter the existing design. So don't touch any of this design here at all. And then don't touch any of the design here at like in terms of the, the logo and then the header and this. Leave this all here, all right? You're only working in the middle. Don't change stuff up. Um, also, make the design fit with the current design, obviously. You wanna make it feel like it's a cohesive part of the design. Um, and, and obviously that means you know paying attention to what type of fonts are currently being used if you decide to put a title here, um, the, the color scheme, the scale, margin padding, alignment, all that stuff. Um, also, um, create the prototype that auto animates once a user clicks find fruit, which is right here. I already talked about that. Um, and yeah, there's two different types of um, 
carousels you can create free scrolling, which is, I uh, it'll show you exactly how to do that. But there's also a type called carousel and page scrolling where you use a drag trigger. Either one is up to you, uh, which whichever one you choose to use. Um, I will link this here as well, this, this article, in the YouTube description if you wanna follow along there, although there are a lot of other resources in YouTube videos on how to do it. And that is essentially it. Um, once you're done, you click up here, and there's some um, details right here as well in terms of how to submit the design, but you click share, and then you just hit copy link right there. Once you do that, we go over to the Discord server, and you go to challenge. So if you're not a member of the Discord server, you'll have to react to a post here. I believe it's in um, it's in one of these, uh, up in assign a role or read me, um, and then it'll unlock all these channels. And then you can come down here to challenge. This is where you submit your design challenge at. All right, and it's gonna tell you one entry per person. Um, only use this channel, submit your entry, don't talk or say anything else. If you have questions, go to channel help right here where you can ask questions about the challenge. Um, an entry should consist of just the Figma prototype URL and that's it, don't say anything else, just submit it. I'll know who submitted it and then um, if you have, obviously you have questions, go to the channel, channel help. Um, and there's going to be two winners, uh, like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, one for the best submission and one for a random winner that's chosen from um, a whole pool of all the submissions. All right, uh, so the winner will receive access to designcourse.com um, and the winners will be announced here on Discord and I may also upload a video on YouTube um, on this channel featuring the best submissions and probably also the one who won as well. All right, so very exciting. I, the submission deadline is December 2nd, so you have two weeks from today to get your submission in and then give us about a week or two after that to you know, go through all the submissions, de determine who's the best, and honorable mentions and all that stuff, and then we'll announce it after that point. All right, very excited to see what you all come up with. And you know, just when it comes to design, try to try to make your very best to try to create designs that are as coherent as possible and they're, they're also, you know, sticking with the theme of the current design. All right, so anyhow, I'll see you all soon and I will be announcing the winners here in about three to four weeks. All right, see you, goodbye.